No more bow bow. Finish. So I think we are on day now. I'm not 100% sure, but I think it is. Uh, it's a little bit busy here, a little bit chaotic. There's really no like order in like how people walk and stuff like that. Uh, it's especially hard when you come from like Japan, where it's very orderly, to Korea, where you know everyone's pushing you and, and pretty much like rushing by. So we're just walking to the next station, which is uh, I think Japjong or something like that. And I think we're a little bit lost, so we've just done a pit stop at a cafe that we walked by, and just grabbing something to drink, something to eat, and then recalibrate, maybe surf the net a bit, and try to find out where we are. Dung Damon right now. Uh, we're gonna do some shopping. Originally we were gonna go to Coex first, but I don't think so we're gonna make it in time uh, for the aquarium and stuff. So we'll leave it until tomorrow, uh, do the aquarium and then shop a bit tomorrow and then go straight to the airport. Uh, we'll actually not straight to the airport, but we'll pick up our bags and go to the airport. Our flight's pretty late tomorrow. I think it's uh, past midnight, 12.30. But yeah, we're just gonna shop around Dong Damon now. So hopefully we'll be able to find a lot of stuff for cheap. Um, if not even expensive, as long as it's good quality, it's all good. Um, so we'll see how it goes. up all the different shopping centers. I think there's probably like over five big massive shopping centers around. My friend recommended Duta, Mil Gores, uh, AM, PM, something like that. And I think we're going to check out the low T one as well. Hopefully we have enough time. Um, I think a lot of these ones open till very late. Um, I could be wrong but, uh, but we'll see how it goes. My hair was getting too long and it was kind of annoying Eva so when I got a haircut probably should have waited to Australia but it wasn't too bad I got a cut at this place behind and they've like Korean fired me I look like a Korean now <laughs> We were shopping for kids clothes, Carson saw like a monkey teddy bear and he really loved it. He was like hugging it and you know running around the shop with it and he just looked really happy so we actually got it for him. It was a little bit on the more pricey end but okay, makes him happy so yeah, let's give it to him now. Carson? Look at Baba Boy Monkey! Huh? Can Baba open for you? Monkey? Yeah. Oh, you sex that monkey? Yeah. Kiss monkey? Yeah. Kissing monkey, yeah? Do you like your monkey? Are you happy, Carson? 
Hug, hug, monkey, hug, hug, monkey, Carson. Ha, hug. Oh, yeah. Look how much he loves the monkey. So sweet. Had to buy for him. Hopefully he'll be a happy boy for the rest of the night. And maybe the rest of the trip, even though there's only like one or two days left. At Shake Shack for dinner, there's not many Korean places around the area. There was some up the top at the food court, a lot more clothing and it didn't look too interesting. So Shake Shack it is. So Eva got the standard shack burger and I got the shroom burger and then we got cheesy fries to share and a drink. The drink is the Asian twist because it's actually just iced tea. It doesn't taste that great. It's actually like just plain tea. Um, I'm not sure if I need to add sugar myself but I haven't actually seen any like sugar or syrup around anywhere to add so I assume that's just how you drink it. for about a year plus. I think last time we had it was when we were in New York last year, it was the year before, um, but it's been quite a while, it still tastes awesome. Condom vending machine and pads vending machine, and probably tampons as well. And it's got other stuff like band-aids, tissues, I think like those hand sanitizers, and some lollies, 